This 60 kilogram Australian born southern white rhino doesn't know how precious, vulnerable and inspiring it is. I can't stop smiling right now. Last year, 11 year old Kapenzi gave birth to its first calf at Werribee Open Range Zoo in Melbourne's west and everyone was overjoyed. But sadly, a few hours after the birth, Kapenzi leaned her two ton frame into the newborn, causing injuries and the calf died. Kapenzi herself was born at Werribee Open Range Zoo and was hand reared by keepers. So there's always been a worry about whether those natural motherhood instincts would be there when needed. But this time it is happening. The new mother is gentle, attentive, and calm. Mother and calf are bonding really, really well and she's being an amazing mum. The pair is being kept in their own private enclosure before the calf is introduced to the herd. Fun fact, a group of rhinos is called a crash. The global crash population of southern white rhinos dropped to as low as 100 in the late 19th century. These days, there are about 10,000 in the wild in Africa and the global population is about 17,000 thanks to conservation efforts and breeding programs like the one here in Australia. So this little calf is vital and it's birth against the odds. But every day, those odds get better. A couple of days old, only 60 kilograms, but already has got such an attitude. He's already kind of like, you know, snorting and stomping and trying to, you know, so yeah, he's gonna be a real handful later on. The little calf is yet to be named and there's going to be a competition to find one. Crash is a good name.